here we're just clearing the overboost code. Two bolts removed, you're going to want to remove the two bolts underneath the EGR manifold that's securing the bottom of this point. With those two Allen head bolts, I should have mentioned that before, this uh, pipe just slides off and the gasket has dropped to the floor, so we'll go and pick that up. Now we're going to get our Mr. Muscle and the head off a WD 40 bottle with the squirting nozzle top. Then with the silicon coast, we've cut this down to half length so it's about a metre long. We're going to stick this down into the exhaust side of the turbo as far as it'll go and then we'll start loading it up with the muster muscle. Then shake the can and load it up until it starts coming out the top. let this sit for about two hours um, and then you're just going to want to rock the actuator arm up and down every few, every 10-20 minutes just to get that Mr. Muscle worked into the veins. Now I've kept spraying the mis uh, fuck. Now I've kept spraying the Mr. Muscle for about uh, two hours and I've kept coming back just checking it and respraying and then moving the actuator arm underneath this diaphragm can't see it well from here but if you look at the diagram you'll be able to understand. Just moving that actuator up and down and uh, we've got a lot more free movement in that now so I'm going to clean all of this up and we'll stick it all back together. Now with everything put back together we're going to go and take the car for a spin because we don't want that oven cleaner sitting inside the turbo overnight. So um, I'm going to let the car warm up, give it some revs and then we're going to go for a quick spin uh, up to about three to 4,000 RPM just to get all of the shit out and then uh, we'll review back after that. So after spanking it, no limp mode, I guess that's problem solved, thanks for watching.